is your boy Joe back at it again codingphase.com listen guys a lot of people been asking me hey Joe we want you to teach us a little bit of Python I want you to come in and just break it down for us make it fun make it interesting make it you know something that we can understand and, and build some cool applications with it hey guys this video is brought to you by viewers like you and people that support our website codingphase.com go check it out over 20 courses in there that's gonna guide you to become a developer from the beginning to becoming a pro okay so I said you know what I'm gonna do that for you guys somehow you found me right so you're probably watching me right now and I said you know what let me give this to you so today we're gonna start with Python very simple one of the easiest language out there um, it's also to one of my favorite ones of course after Ruby but that's another story so let's get started so I want you guys to come in and basically go to repl.it all right go to repl.it this is the home page okay I want you guys to click over here somewhere and just register if you haven't registered just register to the website once you're here in this area, which is like the account section, right? I want you guys to come in and click this little thing, right? You're going to click on all languages. All right. And I want you guys to click on Python three. All right. Now, the next thing that I want you guys to do is come here, edit this, right? You're going to change this to, let's say whatever your name is. So you're going to say for me is Joe Python course all right and then from there just put in a little quick description so we're gonna say hey I'm just trying Python out okay very simple okay we're gonna click here and now I'm gonna tell you exactly what this is so basically think of this as your Python files okay and then here at any moment you could create new files for Python you can also click here to run your code that you put in in this section. Think of this like a text editor, but online, right? And at the same time, you get uh, basically whatever you put in for Python in the codes here is going to run right here. Okay, so let me show you an example. Okay, so I'm going to say two, okay, two plus, oops, two plus two. All right, and then we're gonna say run and it's gonna say four that's it that's all you have to do for now it's very simple very easy okay so the very first thing that I want to do with you guys is talk about variables okay variables is something that you're going to see in every language out there if you've done JavaScript right you already know about variables right you usually will come in and say something like this you say hey var and then you will come in and say var name equals Joe. All right. But in Python, the way how we do this is very simple. All we have to do is say name. Okay. Which is, this is the name of the variable. All right. And then right here, you basically add what's the value of that variable. So you say name is Joe Santos. Garcia and of course just fill in your own name all right now if I come here click run see nothing's happening all right because we're not returning anything so if we want to actually print this to here the compiler well all you have to do is you come here and say print okay and then say name now it actually prints it out for you that's simple okay now I want you guys to understand a variable is just like a box right it's just a box that you come in and you say hey this box I'm giving it a name and inside of it I'm giving it a value and just to make it clear we could name this whatever we want we could say uh, let's say my name just like that right and of course it's case sensitive which means you have to type it exactly how you wrote it so you can say my name just like that all right so it could actually work because if you come here and you put this lowercase 
error. Nothing is happening. You see name. My name is not defined. So basically that variable is not defined. It doesn't exist. All right. It has to be exactly how you wrote it. Okay. So you will come here and say just like that and that will work. All right, guys. So this is a variable, something very easy. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, let me know in the comments if you want to see more of these videos. I'm going to do the whole series about Python here for you guys completely for free. Hope you guys enjoy it. Just when you get a chance, go visit my website, codingface.com. That's the only way that you can support this channel and this amazing content that I'm releasing here to the world. So just go to my website, codingface.com when you get a chance. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.